Hi and welcome to our channel. Here we focus on educating college students about the latest topics in exercise science. Today we'll be talking about lactate metabolism and how it can affect exercise performance, brain function, and cancer. Traditionally, lactate has been viewed as a waste product of anaerobic glycolysis, the process by which glucose is broken down in the absence of oxygen to produce energy. This process occurs during high-intensity exercise or other periods of high energy demand, when the body's oxygen supply is unable to keep up with the demand for energy. The accumulation of lactate in the muscles and bloodstream was once thought to cause fatigue and muscle soreness, leading to the belief that lactate was a harmful waste product of metabolism. Recent research has challenged this traditional view of lactate as a waste product. Dr. George Brooks, a prominent researcher in the field of exercise physiology and metabolism, has proposed that lactate is actually an important fuel source for cells and that it can be used for energy production through a process called lactate oxidation. Dr. Brooks has also studied the role of lactate in cellular signaling and has proposed that lactate can act as a signaling molecule to communicate between cells and tissues. He has suggested that lactate can signal to the liver to stimulate glucose production, also known as gluconogenesis, and that it can also signal to muscle cells to stimulate energy production. Another important concept that Dr. Brooks has proposed is the idea of the lactate shuttle. This refers to lactate being transported between cells and tissues in the body, allowing it to be used as a fuel source where it is needed most. For example, lactate produced in one tissue such as skeletal muscle during exercise, can be transported to other tissues, such as the liver or heart, where it can be used for energy production. Lactate is also important for brain function, where it can be transported from the bloodstream into the brain and taken up by specialized cells called astrocytes. Astrocytes use lactate to produce energy through a process called the astrocyte neuron lactate shuttle, which helps to support the energy needs of nearby neurons. Lactate metabolism in the brain also plays important roles in modulating neurotransmitter levels, regulating blood flow, and protecting against oxidative stress. So, why should we care about lactate's role in brain function? Because it has the potential to improve our cognitive function, memory, and overall brain health. By understanding how lactate metabolism in the brain works, we can develop targeted strategies to optimize our brain function and protect against cognitive decline and to highlight another role of exercise in enhancing overall health. This is especially important for aging adults, athletes, and individuals with neurological disorders. The Warburg effect is a metabolic phenomenon that occurs in some cancer cells, where they produce energy through a process called aerobic glycolysis, instead of the more efficient process called oxidative phosphorylation that typically occurs in normal cells. This process produces lactate, which can help to promote tumor growth and survival. However, recent research has shown that lactate metabolism in cancer cells may also be a potential target for cancer therapy, and researchers are exploring ways to selectively target the metabolic pathways used by cancer cells while sparing normal cells. For example, a study published in the journal Cell in 2017 found that inhibiting lactate transport in cancer cells reduced tumor growth in mice. Other studies have shown that blocking specific lactate transporters can induce cancer cell death and sensitize tumors to chemotherapy. These findings suggest that lactate metabolism may be an important target for cancer therapy, and further research in this area could lead to new treatments for cancer that are more effective and less toxic than current treatments. In conclusion, lactate is an important molecule that plays a significant role in energy metabolism brain function, and cancer. As exercise science majors, it's essential to stay updated with the latest research on lactate metabolism and how it can improve exercise performance and overall health. By incorporating the latest research on lactate metabolism into your training and performance strategies, you can optimize your athletic potential and achieve your fitness goals. Thank you for watching, and we hope you found this video informative and helpful. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel for more educational content on exercise science and related topics.